hello guys welcome back to my channel and today we are going to solve a new lead code question that is a number after a double reversal we are going to solve this question with the help of python and so the question says reversing an integer means to reverse all its digits for example reversing 2021 gives 1202 reversing 12300 gives 321 as the leading zeros are not retained so leading uh, leading zeros are not retained for example if it is 12300 zero, so 00 would be not retained so that was this is all this is the thing in here so if we see here given an integer num reverse num to re uh, get reverse one and reverse one to get reverse two return true if reverse two equals num otherwise false so what we have to do here is guys we have to create uh, two uh, two variables reverse one and reverse two and reverse one would be the reverse of the number and reverse two would be the reverse of the reverse one so we have to check the if whether with the reverse 2 is equal to reverse 1 so what we have to check in here we have to check first of all we have to create a reverse 1 which is reverse of num and then create a reverse 2 which is is reverse reverse of reverse one okay and then and then we have to check that reverse two is equal to num this is all in the question they are asking is so let's start writing the code so before starting writing code please guys to subscribe to the channel press the bell icon button hit the like button for the recent updates and without wasting time we should start writing the code so in here in our visual studio code let me write our first step to create num as an string as a string we should create as here num now we will say that reverse one is equals to num so we have created a reverse order of num here so we say that this is the reverse reverse order of num now we will say that if we return reverse one you can see that we will be getting this number so true false okay so what actually i okay so reverse one save control save and now if you check in here so we are getting 625 and 0081 now if we return if we make this number an integer reverse one is equals to int reverse one and now then we, if we return this thing here reverse one so you can see that we will be getting five six twenty five and eighty one so this this thing we are we will be getting in reverse reverse one so now we have got our variable here that we have made it in the reverse order now we will make another uh, another variable that is a num2 so a reverse 2 and before that we have to create a reverse 1 as a string again because we cannot iterate or uh, index a number so we have to create a, a str now we will create a reverse 2 reverse two is equals to reverse one and now we will say that this is also a negative index here and now save this and if we return all that and control return reverse two so you can see uh, reverse two now if we run this code control save and run this code so you can see that we are getting 5 26 and 18 so now 
we will simply say that z equals to num and we will get our answer so this was so easy to solve this i hope you have understood the concept guys and if you do so please like the video and hit the like button press the bell icon button and subscribe to my channel for recent updates so if you just simply paste in here and you can see that we just have to put the correct indentation and we will simply put it and now we will run this code and see whether we are getting our answer or not so we have got our answer we will check for multiple test, test cases so 1200 and 18 7 any random value and now if you run the code you can see that we are getting our answer correctly so this was all in the question guys thank you guys for watching the video and see you next time